It's five o'clock in the morning. For many people, it's still dream time. But Wang Qianlong doesn't have that luxury. The 26-year-old computer programmer left his hometown four years ago. He now works in an IT company in southwestern Beijing's Fengtai district, more than 30 kilometers away from North Four Village. Wang says the commute is two hours. He has to get up early to avoid what he calls the mess. And just an hour after he gets on the train, we see the mess. Standing room only, inching along, thousands of other commuters, breakfast in hand, yawning, lining up for a mile. Locals tell us they're all outsiders, and the area where one lives is home to about 90,000. Almost all residents here are outsiders. It's 700 to 800 yuan a month to rent a room here, much cheaper than the downtown areas. Although it's too far for them to go to work, transportation doesn't cost as much as rent. In North Four Village, as far as the eye can see, are rental ads. And on rooftops, lining the streets, and even the buildings under construction, all rental housing. One says he can save over a thousand yuan a month living here. Poor lighting, cramped quarters, weak network signals. But one says there are also better jobs, more opportunities, and a brighter future. Perhaps the hardest thing is the loneliness. <laughs> Waving goodbye to parents heading hundreds of miles from home and joining the surge of thousands in suburban Beijing. They will share one goal to make their own Chinese dream come true. And living in those cramped cells only makes them more determined. After a long day's work, they stream back to North Four. One says he's hoping for a promotion and to save more money. Jiang Shaoyi, CCTV, Beijing. If you like what you just saw, follow us on social media and visit our website, cctv-america.com.